Hey, good evening, everyone. So in here, we're gonna go back to this game. Right there. There you are. Okay. It is now time to play Half-Life Blue Shift. Uh, let's see. I should already have these all set up. There we go. There's the sound. Okay. Uh, we can move that to the back. And I can move that to the back. And here we go. Uh, is the training room going to be the same? Let's check it out. Oh no. Oh, it's going to be the same as in Half-Life, but it looks slightly different. To the Black Mesa it is Hazard different. Course for security guard training. I'll be your holographic guide to assist you in your training. Begin by putting on your vest and helmet. You'll find this equipment in the next room. Vest Whenever you and see one of oh. these buttons, press it and I'll repeat instructions or show you how things are done. Sure thing, me. I'm going to turn down the game volume just a bit real quick. Looks like it's kind of loud. I hope that's not the case. Because I have no idea. OBS is not helpful in this regard. Here okay. you will find your standard armor vest and helmet. These will help protect you against any physical threat you may encounter while performing your duties. When your armor becomes too damaged to be useful, You'll need to find a fresh vest or helmet to protect yourself. Alright then. What happens if I jump over the edge? Ah, I won't get I'm not gonna do it this time. That'd be crazy. Moving around in your armor may be a little tricky at first. Take a moment to get a feel for moving around. Once you get comfortable with this, proceed to the next section just around the corner. Th that corner? Okay, you're not going to help me out, are you? Okay. The first move you'll need to practice is jumping. You'll have to get over all three of these obstacles in order to proceed. It helps to get a running start. Watch me do it, then try it yourself. Oh, he's going to do it. Go, 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 man. Disappear. The next set of obstacles. When you crawl in a crouched position, you can move very silently. This can be very useful when you don't want to be heard. He's not going to show me. All right. Very good. I hardly noticed you. Thanks, Do Thanks, Doctor Coomer. I love you, Doctor Coomer. Try combining moves. You'll need to jump, duck, and then jump again. This should get you prepared for the next room, where you'll have to do both moves at the same time. Oh god. That sounds horribly complex. Good work. You look prepared for the next station. Bubby! It's Bubby, everyone. To get into these pipes, you'll need to perform a duck jump. You'll want to stand right at the mouth of the pipe. While moving forward, jump up and hold the jump button to go into a crouch in midair. It may be tricky at first, but you'll find it comes in handy to be able to jump and duck into tight areas. <laughs> he said it. Ah, get out of there. Ah! Nice work. Uh, oh. So this is mostly the same map as the one in Half-Life. The original Half Life. Walk directly into the ladder, look up, and continue moving forward. If you want to climb back down, just move backward. Alright. Hello. There we go. The next four jumps get more difficult each time. Don't worry if you miss the last one a few times, just climb up and do it again. If you can make all the jumps in a continuous run, you're doing just fine. Let's do it. Yeah. Was that 17 lateral feet that I just jumped? That's... That's pretty hardcore. To start the lift, walk up to the button and press the use key while facing it. Now that you're up here, there's only one 
one way down. Find the target on the floor below and do your best to hit it. You, you son of a bitch. You damage from the fall, but don't worry about it. We'll give you some first aid in the next section. Dude, I'm gonna break my legs. You son of a bitch. I'm gonna go find that hologram and kick his ass. Kits like this one throughout the Black Mesa Research Facility. To restore your health, walk up to a med kit, then press and hold your use key. Your health will recover gradually until you're at full health or until the kit is depleted. Once the light goes out, a med kit cannot be reused. All right. You may also find HEV oh. charging stations such as this one throughout the facility. These stations, however, can only be used by qualified science personnel wearing powered hazardous environment equipment. So they will be inaccessible to you during your duties. <laughs> duties. To spin that bridge, walk up to the control wheel and press the use key. Great job. Sometimes you'll need to rely on quick reflexes to get around. Try jumping this gap on your own. Okay, what but I don't like... What you really need to do oh. is push the box down into the pit. Pushing is easy. Just move forward into the box and you can push it into position. Push it into position. I push that box into position. If you can't push an obstacle out of the way, you might try pulling it. To pull a box, move up to it and press your use key. While holding down the use key, move backwards and the box will be pulled with you. Stepping on cockroaches. Don't like stepping on cockroaches. All right, so now they're testing me like a monkey going for bananas. Nothing else works. You can try breaking things that block your path. Pick up the crowbar and smash your way through the boxes. Yes, finally a weapon. All must die. Yes. Ah, worth a shot. You'll need to use your flashlight for the next area. I'm actually probably going to have to turn my um, brightness up. Sorry, Calhoun. I'm on duty. Yeah, whatever. Turn the lights back on, dude. I'm a little busy right now, Calhoun. Fine. Can I not get out of here? Am I stuck? Did I just stick myself in here? Oh my god. Really? I didn't save. Oh my gosh, 
In the original version of this, that door opened. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, okay, well, when's the last quick save or auto save they gave me? None? Alright, I'm about to assume that the rest of this is just the same. You're kidding me here. This is crazy. You can't get out here. Alright, I am not redoing the entire training uh, run again. So... This man died for nothing. That is a huge oversight. Alright, um, I assume the next parts are like weapons training and um, long jump, maybe long jump training. But, uh, hey! Yeah, let's see, if, let's activate. Uh, I'm pretty sure no clip won't work unless I turn SV cheats on. Alright, so SV cheats. One and no clip, no clip on. All right. No clip off. SV sheets zero. All right. Great. Remember. Your flashlight will lose power over time, so switch it off when you don't need it. When the flashlight is off, it will recharge itself. Alright. Well, that was a huge oversight. Hey, Kachan, thanks for making me think of it. Okay, yeah, weapons training. You'll get a chance to fire your weapon, reload, and fire the attached grenade launcher. Collect your equipment and proceed to the firing station. Yes, sir. You'll need to hit every target to complete the course. If you miss, don't worry about it. The targets will keep moving until you manage to score a hit. If you want to get through the target range as quickly as possible, try reloading during pauses instead of letting your gun run out of ammunition at a critical time. You to got fire it. the grenade launcher, use the alternate fire button. Some targets can only be destroyed by lobbing grenades. I'll start the sequence in five, four, three, two, one. So the display will let you know when oxygen becomes critical. That means you'll need to find some clean air to breathe. As you swim through this course, your blood oxygen levels will begin to drop. At the midpoint, you'll be given an opportunity to surface for air. Dude. This is a live training course. I don't think I want to do this. I mean, I probably would, because I can see the next area. Like, in real life, I would do this. But you hear about, like, those Navy SEALs who almost drown during training. To the surface and catch your breath. You regain health lost from holding your breath too long once you've made it to the surface for air. Go ahead. I'm sure he was just saying go ahead and finish the course. But you hear about, like, people who, like, they're super confident. <laughs> and they're well trained and they still have instructors and yet they still have training deaths not so many but I know I'm the one who's gonna be the unlucky one 
come up in your heads up display. Directional indicators at the center of your display will show you from what direction damage is coming. I have a question, Mr. Hologram. How do we have a heads up display when we do not have any sort of like glass covering our face? Huh. You know, it's it, you know, it's just kind of kind of weird. Proximity to radiation activates a Geiger counter and radiation display in your helmet. Many other biological and chemical hazards are also indicated in your head-up display. Please proceed to the next section. This is where they have the long jump in the uh, regular ha hazard course. They might not have that because I don't think that exists in this game. Ah, yes. They have changed the hazard course here. Lead a scientist into the next room. He will open the door that leads back into the transit system. To have someone follow you, approach the person and press your use key. He will then follow you until you face him and press the use key again. Sir, what is a use key? I don't think I have one of those on my body. Okay, I'm just going to go up and press my belly button. That should work, right? Is that my use key? Here we go. Yes, I will follow you if you wish. Alright, walk up to him and press my belly button. Soda. Soda. Your handwriting sucks, sir. Melimesh fornum forn I think that second one is fornicate. What are you working on? I don't think you can read. Okay. Access granted. So long, suckers. Press your use key to engage the train. Once engaged, move forward or backward to button? increase or decrease the speed of the train. Press the use key a second time to disengage from the train. Whoa, my belly button has so many uses. Into the ether we go. Congratulations on completing the Black Mesa Hazard Course for security guards. All right. Now certified to join the Blue Shift High Security Unit. All right, guys, good game. Kind of short. I like it. Alright, we'll go medium again. I've just been playing all these on medium. Hard isn't very hard in this game, but... Good morning. Good morning. And welcome to the Black Mesa Transit System. Ah, this loser. Is provided for the and he missed his bus. playing. Uh, ah, dang it. destination is a high security area beyond sector C. You will need to board a high security train at the central transit hub. If you have not yet submitted your identity to the retinal clearance system, you must report to Black Mesa personnel for processing 
before you will be admitted to the high security branch of the transit system. If you wish to transfer to the sector B or C medium security lines, you may do so before you reach the central transit hub at the area 9 security checkpoint. Access to the medium security branch of the transit system is for employees Place is cool. of the Black Mesa Research I there. Facility and authorized visitors I there. only and requires that you wear your security badge at all times. All right. Calhoun. Hey. Looks like we're in for a long day today. Have a good one, Calhoun. Oh, okay. I'm going down. This Subject, be a Calhoun. So, I think we used to think system. education. Two years this of Martinson College. Undecided major. Of the Black Mesa facility. Employer, sure Black Mesa Research Facility. At all times. Position, security officer. Now, initially, I think we thought that Barney, oh, assignment area three security. Initially, we thought that Barney was the police officer you saw, clearance level three, police officer that you saw at the beginning of, ugh, come on, disaster response priority, preser preservation of facility, equipment, and materials. I'm on the lookout for the G-man here. Secondary priority, welfare of research personnel. Low priority, personal safety. Now arriving. Okay, this door. <gasps> oh, it is! Okay. So, at the very beginning of the, the first Black Mesa, the first um, Half-Life game, you see a security officer pounding on this door as Gordon. And it turns out that's Barney. Let me in! Let me in! Hey! Hold on a minute. The door's not responding to your pass ID. Let me see if I can get it open on this side. Don't, don't take too long. Gordon's coming to kill me. Hey, Gordon. Gordon. Gordon, where are you going? Hey, buddy. Buddy. Gordon. Gordon, where are you going, buddy? Gordon, come back. Gordon. Okay, I think I got it. What an asshole. I hate that guy. Sorry about that, Calhoun. We've been having problems all over the facility this morning. System crashes, security malfunctions. It's a wonder this whole place hasn't shut down yet. Huh. I'll give it a few minutes. So, you look exactly like me. And that's weird. But, uh, we're gonna move past that. Calhoun, you know you can't go on duty without your sidearm and uniform. You want to try me? I can take care of anything, barehanded. I'm the Alpha Calhoun. Ah, uh, it's not going to explode. Hello, everybody. Guess we got I laid last night. Show up this morning, Calhoun. Yeah, yeah, I know. Problems with the access system. Hope you're ready for a long shift. Heh, <laughs> it is gonna be a long shift. It's also gonna be my last one. I can't round. access my files. I can't answer my mail. I haven't even been able to get into my office. I know, sir, I know. We're doing everything we can to get the problem Ooh, under me. control. Just give us some time. Time? To... I don't have any more time. If I'm not able to get my report to the administrator in the next hour, then my job will be in serious jeopardy, and I'll make sure that mine is not the only one. <sighs> Bobby. Training saves lives. The future. Success. Alright, so... This is probably not the way to go, because I want to go to the armory first. Oh, I gotta get both, actually. It doesn't matter. Ah! I needed that. Ew. Ooh, shower time. No, oh, no shower. Oh, 
of these work. Oh! Wait, did the toilet splash? Ah, uh, toilets don't flush. Okay. But the hand drawers work. Nice. Jones, Track, Cody, Phillips, some Lombardi, Vever, Hood. Where's mine? Where's mine? Okay, so they do all make noises. Did I say Hood? Hood. <laughs> Whoops. Alright. I don't get a locker? Oh, wait, neither. Okay, oh, something open too. Ooh, a box. The truth about aliens and government conspiracies. Ooh, I have pictures. Aw. I got a girlfriend. I got a girlfriend. Uh oh, now what? What? Looks like some people are having problems with the main access lift in Sector G. Why don't you go over there and see what you can do? Okay, but I don't even have a gun yet. I'm guessing I want to go to... Oh, let's go video surveillance first. Oh! I can't get in. Good morning, hey! Gordon! Gordon. Whenever Gordon's not on the screen, everybody should be saying, Where's Gordon? What's Gordon doing? Huh? He's looking at porn. Oh, hey! There's the anomalous material. Being delivered by the lady from Half-Life, um, the PS2 version. Uh, crap, I can't remember. It was Half-Life. I don't remember what it was called. Resonance or something? Still on the lookout for G-Man. I don't think he shows up so much in this uh, adventure. I don't think he shows up at all. Hey buddy, stop How's with the corn. I need a gun. Is he actually... He's reading... Oh, he's reading a magazine about guns. I know you're not on for a couple more days, but if you want to squeeze in a few shots in the range, there's plenty of room. Alright. Uh, I'm just here for the ammo. Good enough. Decay, thank you. It is Half-Life Decay. Um, I think they had a choice between male and female protagonist in that. And so we got to Half-Life Alex. the only time they had a female protagonist. Kind of a sausage fest down here in Black Mesa. Same, by the way. Okay, oh, you can answer that later. Hey, buddy. What you working on? Working on something important? Am I bugging you? I'm not bugging you, am I? Okay, good talk. What are you thinking, bud? Help. That doesn't sound right. Let me help uh. you. Okay, 
I hope you know what you're doing. Of course. Theoretically. Oh yeah, that Do you smell something burning? I can't really tell. Right. Let's try this. Oh god. <coughs> okay. Well, do you have any idea what to do next? I couldn't even venture a guess. Who is responsible for this mess? <gasps> even the Shouldn't you be guarding some donuts and coffee right about now? Yes, sir. Dude. Harsh. I don't think that was actually supposed to be Eli Vance. Oh, okay. So you play co-op mode where you play Dr. Gina Cross and Dr. Colette Green. Okay. I actually should probably play that. I've never even touched it before. That should be part of my Half-Life playthroughs. I'd have to go find it, though. You do not talk to the security like that. Do you hear me? I don't care who you are. to Sector G, then you're probably better off walking it. I overheard someone say that all the trams on this end of the facility are having problems. Hmm. Unforeseen consequences, you say? No, he just said problems. Alright, down we go then. Dude, I don't know about anybody else, but I love going places I'm not allowed to be. Like, I would totally crawl down in here and just look around. I'm one of those people that you hear that, like, what were they doing there? They'd be like, well, they were just kind of curious. Oh, I don't have a crowbar. Can I not move this? Is there anything behind it? Okay, there's nothing behind it. Can I get a crowbar, please? Oh, there's so many boxes I want to break. You really cock blocked me on this whole crowbar sitch. I don't know it's not too great, but I really haven't been paying much attention to it. I haven't really thought about it in years. I, I really should try to find it, though. Ooh, ooh, G-Man! G-Man! I'm, I'm a big fan. Autograph. I want your, I want your autograph. Please, G-Man. G-Man. Oh, please. After Gordon snubbed me, I, I, I love you. <sighs> they deserve each other. G-Man and Gordon. Both huge freaking assholes. Level three dorm. Oh, level three dormitory. Sector G hydroelectric area three security and freight yard. Sector C test labs. So I guess somebody actually went through and figured out what all the lines would have to be in Black Mesa for all the train different trains that we see. Somebody actually figured it out and boiled it down to one poster that people might glance at. Well, it's about time. We don't Fuck off. you people to mosey around at your own convenience. Make this thing work so we can get on with this miserable day. Quick save. <laughs> oh, I am so tempted. This is a real bad look. A cop pointing a gun at a black man. You know, you didn't say anything. You're cool.
I thought about it, man. It's a good thing you're gonna be dead in like five seconds. Why are all the scientists at this place dicks? these guys. Oh, here we are. Oh god. No. Oh god, he's dead. Oh, he's dead too. When did that happen? Oh god! Puppy even eating him with it has no mouth and it must scream. Uh. Uh, was it good for you too? I guess the other guy is just a red smear on the ground. Well, that's what happens when you get into an elevator with me. Super puppy! Hey! Small material storage area, okay. I will be smashing every single box I see. That's just a given, right? How could you not? It's like a overflowing of joy every time I see those boxes break into little tiny pieces. level 4. Damn it, I only have a level 3 security clearance. This guy had a level 4? Doesn't look like it. This guy? Give me just a second. I gotta find a way out of here. Oh yeah, there was more over here.
Oh. I probably should have shot that. If it opens when the power goes out, that's just dumb. It's not very secure. I don't like the looks of this. Probably electrified. Oh. And we have head crab sign. Well, let's try stepping on it and see if it kills us. It does indeed kill us. Alright. Jump. Oh shit. Ha. <laughs> Idiot. He's not a smart thing like I am. You're just a dumb animal. Oh god, he got me. Okay. Break the damn box, stupid. There we go. Uh, there's a way up there. Is there any way forward here? Ah! Here we go! Aha! Um... What happens if I shoot those? Nothing? I can't I can't shoot them from here. Um I guess you can come back from the other side. Ah, you son of a bitch. Alright, oh, what does this say? Anything special? It says nothing. through the canal. If you do make it to the surface, don't tell anyone I'm down here. I think they're trying to kill us all. Now get out of here. The canal is where you want to be. So apparently Calhoun slept from the time the Resonance Cascade started. Well, slept. Was in a coma from the time the Resonance Cascade started until the time the, uh, oh, I see what I'm supposed to do here. Until the time uh, the military was here and already trying to kill everybody. So he was up for a good chunk of time then. Please leave me alone. I don't want them to hear us. If you want to escape, go through the canal. So at this point, Gordon Freeman's already running from the military. And uh, Adrian Shepard, I guess, is somewhere. Just uh, knocking around. I don't think we see him in this adventure. Uh, opposing force is kind of half cannon. Not full cannon. But then, the story of this game series is nebulous at best. Full of places where you have to fill in the blanks. try my best not to safe scum this whole thing. But it's really hard not to. Okay, so I won't be able to get in the north tunnel no matter what I do. I'm sure there's going to be enemies in here. We're 
just hiding the, uh... Yeah, we're hiding the loading zone here. Hello, friend. Thanks for the ammo. Okay, I think that's everything. Yep. Oh, one more. I'm still trying to decide whether I should buy Doom Eternal or not. sale. Uh, what is the sale right now? Um, gotcha. Like, how much is it usually and how much is it now? like $16 I can buy the deluxe edition, which is normally like 70 Oh, oh, that is tough. I was going to say no, because you just spent all your money on a motherboard and uh, RAM and stuff, but, ooh, $16, hmm, I'd go for it. I could go for that. Uh, how am I supposed to do this? Uh... Oh, this one goes down too. That looks good. I don't think that's good enough. Right there, maybe? Just breaking, y'all. Oh, just a pipe fitting. That's a pretty good, dang good price. Yeah, that's a that's that's pretty good. I usually wait for like Christmas or summer sales. Okay, I'm gonna let them come to me. But I'd probably go for that. trick with these guys is you can beat them to death if you can hit them before they start firing their electric lasers. Of course, as soon as they see you, they do, but they run out and they get him. Oh, sh what the fuck? He teleported into me. Oh, that was a close one. Shit, I didn't know he'd be behind me. So the thing you learn about Vortigaunts is that they are actually enslaved. These uh, collars and wristbands actually turn them into mind-controlled slaves for Nihilanth. 
and by extension the combine. So yeah, I'm just beating these guys to death. They don't deserve it at all. In fact, let me try and see what the price at previous sales were like. Yeah, go to SteamDB. See how far down it usually gets. Because if it gets less during a winter sale, I'd say wait. Is there something up here? Sounds like there's some water running below me. Can I... I still, I played Doom 3, I think was the last one I played. It was kind of a revival, it was like, I think like 2005. Uh, I haven't played any Doom since then, so all the Dooms are new to me. And in fact, you bring up a good point. I should be playing Doom soon. there's something down below me but I think that's just a yeah okay that's just a return oh I am too curious ah poop it only shows the normal game I can't see the deluxe edition even though you, you tried steam DB Is this going to kill me if I go in here? Okay, it looks like I have to stop those. Ah, okay. Oh! Alright, reload. Um, let's see what's over here. to do here is that going to shut off the steam hmm, I guess that's one of the valves oh wait there it is okay good glad you found it There's too many ways to go here. I can't map it in my head. I guess I'll just keep going until I figure it out. Here's another valve. Okay, yeah, 75% is the lowest it's gotten, which is what is it now? If I buy the franchise bundle, I can save a tiny bit more money, of which I have every game except Doom Eternal. <sighs> Ain't that just the way? Oh, I see what you're saying. You already have every game except Doom Eternal. Okay, cool. Yeah. Yeah. I'm glad that they do that. They give you, like, the bundle price. Yeah, minus the games you already own. At least you don't have to pay for games you already have. Ah. I guess that's just to show you what's going to happen. Alright, so this isn't working. Alright. Alright, that's locked. I just turned that off. Is there anything else up here? I don't think there was. No, that door is broken. Okay. Drainage canal exit. Oh! Oh, I don't like the implication here. 
guy with the shotgun right next to him. Oh, he killed himself, and he was able to see the way out. He just couldn't reach it. Oh, Dr. Coomer. Dr. Coomer. No, no, no. But still, in his position, it'd hardly say what I would do. Okay, so all I did was go down there and get a shotgun. Oh, in fact, I think I bought the bundle last time trying to buy a Doom Eternal before I had to refund it because my computer at the time couldn't handle it. Oddly enough, they let me keep the BFG edition of Boom th Doom 3, though, which is pretty nice. Yeah, pretty nice. Can I get up there? What? No, I can't get up there myself. Oh, hold on a second. Got to turn on the volume on my TV. Okay, so I turn off the valves. Still nothing opening. Okay, the TV is a lot louder on this episode than it was on the previous one. Jesus. Alright, I'm a little, I'm a little confused now, so give me a second to get my bearings. and disposal, 10 feet. Alright, so I gotta get to that lift control. Yeah, I need to buy Doom 2016 and Doom Eternal and whatever and whatever and whatever. There's a bunch of games I haven't played. I've done the initial four, you know, Doom, Final Doom, Lost Chapters, whatever. They're all, they all have different names. I did those. And then I did Doom 3, which I don't remember why. Oh, yeah, because there was Doom 2, Hell on Earth. Oh, right there. I've already been here. I played through Doom 3. Oh, that's right here. No? Like I said, I played through Doom 3, but I don't remember much about it. Yeah, I don't have an HUV suit. There we go. Do I have to get down there quick? Oh no, it's coming down. Seriously? <sighs> Why did it not explode? Explosives not explode. <sighs> We're just moving on. Supposed to do? 
probably going to regret that decision in the morning, but you know what? I've been dealing with an ear infection the past few days. I've earned this. I say yes, Kachan. You have earned it all. I think I see another Vortigaunt there. Yeah, it's a Vortigaunt. Alright, let's look at this logically. There's the lift I want to use. There's the lift that just came down. This doesn't do anything. How come that one's not working? Is there another control panel here? I would love to help Sai Sai, but I haven't played Blue Shift like 10 plus years. Yeah, me too. Uh, don't worry about it. I will figure this out. We're playing this game for real. Um. Let's see, I see an explosive box. I see a control panel. Let me try shooting it. This door is forever closed. That door is not going to open either. Did the ladder come down here? The ladder did not come down. Okay, yeah, according to Steam, I haven't played it since June 29th, 2012. Called it. That's more than 10 years. Is it 2023? Oh my god, it's 2023. Okay, nothing here, nothing here, nothing here. And I fell all the way down. Is there any way through here? Nothing underwater? Those are still going. This is where I came from. Waste crushing and disposal. I mean, that sounds pretty hard. Oh, oh. Oh, is there? Oh, there's a ladder here. all that back there? What's with the crushing and the, and the, and the, what the? Okay, I'm gonna go forward a bit. something. Flow control. Yes. Uh oh, I might die.
get me, big man. Did he fall? He just fell. Come and get me. Hello. I'm tempted to save, but I still don't know what happened to that place I just left. Why won't you die? Weird. Okay, looks like I gotta cross the pipe. Ouch. Bottomless pits now. I feel like I missed something important back. Oh god. Oh god. Do you think it's okay? I definitely missed something back there. Uh, oh, fuck me. Reload. Alright. So that was obviously the correct way to go. How? Oh, this is still the correct way to go. Am I just supposed to, like, go through the crushers? There's no way I can get through there. Yeah. That's what I thought. Okay, where the hell am I? Oh, okay. At least it'll load me back there. So, let's explore a little bit more. If I can't find it, I will give up. this not work? There's no ladder. Okay, yeah, um, fine. I'm just going to go forward. And if I come back here, great. If not, I guess that place will be forever a mystery to me. Ladies, you can both have me. I'm sure he's fine. Hey, got a new body armor for me. I just want the shotgun shells, though. Hey, buddy, you're hiding back there. actually so safe. Uh, yeah, I'll go back and grab that body armor now. There's no reason to save it. Oh, what did that say? Excess water from canal flooding. But it's been dry the past several years. We're in the desert. Oh, shit. <sighs> okay, we'll live with it. I definitely should have shot him to death. In 
fact, why don't I do that before I grab the uh, stuff? Okay, now I'll grab the stuff. So I guess this game is a little bit different in that you're only going to find armor for one-time dealios. There's not going to be any place to stock up on armor. Shit. Shit. This is going badly. This is going very badly. <sighs> okay. That was just kind of mean, actually. just happened. I guess they want me to use the shotgun there. Fucking hell. Just forage down ahead, I guess. Wait, is there anything under here? There is nothing. Shit, obviously. I played Castlevania earlier. I'll probably get around to, uh... I was thinking Mega Man 2, but now I kind of want to play Doom. I play old games. I should just say, I play old games. All of them. Okay, that's got... Oh, what's... What? Oh, yeah. Nothing under here. How do I activate it to go back up? Do I have to... Warning, keep explosive material out of canal. Oh. Basically, you want to do whatever the sign says not to do. Vaya con Dios. I'm a freaking genius. Alright, so I started kind of later than I wanted to, so I'm probably only go, going to go for about two hours tonight. So I'll finish up probably about 1 a.m. Eastern Time. Shepard is canon. 
All right, they dumping scientists down here. Oh, I guess the corpses just vanish. All right, so those guys did mention Alan Shepard or Adrian Shepard. Is that a uh, Vortigaunt? No, it's a pipe. Captive Freight. Chapter 3, I guess. How much ammo do I have? Oh, okay. I am not full on ammo. Ah, this is where that guy shot himself. Poor guy. Well, onward and upward. God, how did I live without an SSD for games? That's a 90 gigabyte game I just installed in 10 to 15 minutes. Yeah, I actually live in a place with fiber internet now, and downloading stuff from Steam is like just a couple seconds. Okay, I don't go there yet. This sounds like it's gonna kill me. some body armor real quick guys ah uh, well I guess it was worth it it just gave me like a shitload of explosives part where I have to save some scientists in rail cars. What do we got here? Ah, body armor. Good. And a magnum. I dropped this monster condom for my magnum dong. That's, that seat is way too close to the dashboard. Sir, you'll never be comfortable like that. You can move the seat back, sir. Sir. Tap, tap, tap. Sir. The people just ignore me when I try to talk to them in their cars. Steam tunnel access. Okay. Oh. Um. Oh shit. So I'm guessing they're not going to let me through. Nope. Yeah, we specifically chose to move to a place with fiber internet. And it goes pretty well. But I mean, I don't know if it justifies the extra cost. We don't use it that often. Oh shit! Danger, high temperature steam pipe. Yep, it hurts me. Can I get back there? Get in there. I guess the only option is to go this way. I hear some. Wait. Oh, these are hot pipes. Okay. 
Honestly, the internet here isn't really bad, but still, I'm getting really greedy now. I have a decent computer for the first time in my life. I agree. Um, it's like, I guess it would be- oh, what's gonna happen here? Oh, it's just like an airlock system. Yeah, I guess I, if I needed more, like, internet-heavy, like, throughput stuff, this would be great. Especially for uploads, since you get a gigabyte down and a gigabyte up. But really, I mean, I'm just downloading large files irregularly, like not all the time. Pressure release valve. Looks like we're gonna have to take some pain to use this. Okay, good. To go through Barney had to go through a lot worse stuff than Gordon did. Uh, let's see. I'm having a little trouble seeing what I'm doing here. Actually, now that I think about it, let me turn my monitor brightness up a bit. What's the stream look like? Ah, oh, stream's not great either. Maybe I should turn the gamma of the game up. Uh, can I swim downward? Where am I going? are broken. Maybe I need to shut those off. No, they just end. High temperature steam pipes, again. I can't reopen that door. I saw some bubbles. Oh. Oh. Well, that was just staring me right in the face. Hopefully it's not a long elevator. I 
here get crabs warehouse basement hi head crab Dude, come over here and get me. Come on. You can do it. He's not gonna do it. There's going to be somebody teleporting in here, I just know it. Damn it! Okay. Really? I should have just shot him in the face in the first place. there, god dang it. But I did nothing about it. Shit! I didn't even hear it. I didn't even hear that one. Nice. Okay. I'm just checking out what's down here. This looks like the right way to go. So let's go the other way first. Sounds like the Hypnotoad over here. Obey the Hypnotoad. Oh, glory to the Hypnotoad. Okay, we're done. That, that's all that's over here? to avoid.
Block pushing puzzle? Yeah, block pushing puzzle. Stupid. I might be doing this backwards. Never mind. I knew it. I knew it. I always take that opportunity to put one right around the corner. Nope, not getting up there. They're really enjoying dropping the head crabs on me right now. More high temperature steam pipes. Gordon had the easy way out. I really wish it wasn't midnight here because I really want to launch Doom Eternal. <laughs> you want to go play Doom Eternal? I, I wholeheartedly endorse this project. Who's shooting whom? Alright, I got some armor there. We got a box full of gears. Ha ha ha. Very clever. Alright. So I'm gonna leave this. I'm gonna leave this until I need it more. So let's save. And let's go fight the US military as a freaking security guard. I got one. Alright. Wasn't so bad. Steam tunnel access, elevator, main stairwell. Ah, Big shot booby. I appreciate your help, but I'm afraid those bastards did their damage already. That's not booby. If you were trying to reach the freight yards in hope of escaping, then just forget about it. The military is rounding up everyone and everything they can find, and either killing them or bringing them up here for questioning. A colleague and I came up with our own plan for escape, and we were on our way to one of the old prototype labs when we ran into them. But listen to me. If you still want to get out of here alive, your only hope may be to find my friend. <coughs> if you can get past the soldiers, find Dr. Rosenberg. With him, you may have a chance to get out of this place. Do you have like a sandwich or something I can eat? I'm kind of hungry. Let's rifle through his desk. Um, S. Reardon. And yes, if you're worried, wondering, Dr. Magnuson in this game is the same one in Half-Life 2 Episode 2 at the very end. Or actually, throughout the week, or whatever. So this, this, uh, this mostly hooks into Half-Life 2 in that Barney escapes the facility and... Dr. Magnuson is with him. Alright, oh, there's a baby picture. 
Let's look at this guy's family. Aww. Your baby's so cute, man. Why don't you tell me you had a baby? Look with this guy forever. I didn't know he had a baby. Okay, where are we going? Oh, shit. Okay, in case this door closes behind me, I'm saving. Because I still need to go get that armor. Gonna explode if I shoot him. Yes, they are. Oh god, I don't like how much health they're giving me here. Alright, let's go get that armor I left behind. was a trap. <sighs> oh well. At least we know we can heal. Nvidia is saying that my optimal settings for Doom Eternal is RTX on. That's kind of an optimism to put my poor th that's kind of that's a lot of optimism to put into my poor 3050. I don't know, man. You can... You probably do it. Probably not at, like, uh, 4K or anything. Oh, wait. Ar armor's not worth 100? It's only worth 60? Well, that sucks. I'm gonna continue on, though. Save. Who said these soldiers were smart? Ah! But he got me. all the help. Shit! Where's he shooting from? That was him? Come on, get back here. Get back here! Shut up. <laughs> Alright, what, what floor is this? This feels like the right way to go. Definitely the right way to go. We're getting out of here.
Wow, I'm nearly dead. Oh, good. Okay. They're, it sounds like they're coming for me. gone worse. Alright, let's go back and see what we missed. Most of this blood is mine. God, that door opening sound is so nostalgic for me. I think it's second only to the Doom's door sound effects. Yeah. Alright. Uh, okay, good. I don't, I'm not a fan of how much life I'm missing. Okay, so this is the second floor. Yeah, the sound design in these games is really good. Instantly recognizable. Oh, these were the guys that closed the door in my face earlier. Okay, okay. Ooh, are we full? Yeah, we're full on ammo. Cool. So this is the intended route then. Cool. I just sort of stumbled upon it. Oh, what is this? Nothing. I used to play this old Half-Life mod that nobody really knows about a fucking ton back in the day, so I heard about these sound, these sound effects a lot. I used to play um, Team Fortress Classic a lot and Sven Co-op. Uh, Sven Co-op was probably my favorite because I don't like fighting against real people. Uh, and then in Team Fortress Classic, there was a uh, server called the Silly Zone that I always played on. And it was more focused on just having fun rather than killing each other. Yeah, Sven Co-op was great. It, it, it's still going. I mean, you can still play it, obviously. Um, they've got a bunch of, like, wacky maps that are just, like, find your way across. And there's just, like, I don't want to say opt obstacle courses, but just, like, weird things that you'd never think to do. People were really creative. Alright, at least there's some health here. That's good. But yeah, if you've never played Sven Co-op, basically it was a mod that just took the original Half-Life maps and let you go through them in co-op mode. And then people started adding, like, their own maps and stuff. Is somebody talking to me? I think somebody is. should put more in these boxes. I played those a fair amount too. What was the mod that you played a lot of? Was it Natural Selection? I know that was a big one. Help! Someone let us out of here! Rescued at last! Thank God you're here! No, I'm afraid I'm not Dr. Rosenberg. Oh. He's not Dr. Rosenberg. It sounds like there's something in here I don't want to see. Yep. Wow. Wow. He just, like, Pepe... Not Pepe Le Pew. Um... <sighs> What's the word? What was that mouse's name? The fast one. He just speeds Speedy Gonzalez away from my bullets. Oh, 
Do you remember the name of the mod? Or just not remember? Do you just not recall? There's like a shitload of enemies here. Come on, come for me. Oh god, there's so many. <laughs> what the fuck are they doing? It's gotta be more, right? Oh, okay. Proof not sake is the player base was pretty small. People might be using it and try to figure out who I am and stuff. Oh, okay. No, no, that's perfectly valid. It's the same reason I don't tell anybody my last name. It'd be really easy to find me. Aha, aha, he tried to put me over. And he still might. I gotta find some health. God damn. I didn't want to save. I'm so close to death. Okay. 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 That's good enough to save, I think. But I gotta watch out for enemies. Oh, good. feel so bad anymore. Hello? Can anyone hear me? I can hear you. What do you mean? Your last name is Sama. You know what? Good enough. Yeah, close enough.
Uh, can I break? Oh yeah, I can do this. I couldn't, it took me forever to figure out that out the first time I played this game. Dr. Rosenberg, but you'll still help me. Or Rosenberg, whatever. Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll, I'll do what I can. scatter so quickly. Can I... Can I sneak up on him? Come on! Come the fuck on! I can't believe none of them died. There's a lot of dudes! Did the scientists survive this time? Oh, he did! Even though he's standing out in the open, you idiot! You constant, just monumental idiot! destroy the entire United States military. You fucking moron. Okay. Ooh, rocket launcher.
I used to think these guys were just in it for the GI Bill. Can I destroy this thing? Nope, I need the rocket launcher. I should have saved before starting this. I have no, no idea how many rockets it takes. That many rockets. Okay. I think everybody's dead. up this section and then I'm going to call it a night. Go to bed. Like a good little girl. room is. Okay, that was pretty cool. I liked that. Ah, okay. Damn it, he saw me. Training real close to the screen. Where are you at, buddy? I know you lived. I think you lived. Well, only one way to find out. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Or did I? Uh, I'll wait until I'm done with clearing this area. I'm pretty sure, like, 5,000 enemies come blasting through the doors. Did he kill himself? I think he killed himself. Oh, good for me. Freight warehouse. Alright. 
A to R5, turntable controls. I have a feeling this is going to bring a lot of enemies into, into my, the area. Oh, okay, I see. I remember this being a very extensive battle. Basically, I'm getting rid of as much cover as I can here. Oh, I fell. Gotta be careful, that's a good place to get scissored in half. Hello! Yeah, hello. Here. Can anyone hear me? Nope. I'd have to use the turntable again, but that was wrong. Hey, Dr. Rosenberg. What's the status on Freeman? Yes, I'm hey. Dr. Rosenberg. Although I'm not very proud to admit it, seeing as though I'm partially responsible for all of this. How did you know my name? Oh, I see. Uh, Scott Lord told me. Harold. Yes, our oh, Harold. plan was to get to one of the old prototype labs. It involved something that very few people in the facility are authorized to know about. The same technology that brought about this catastrophe could also be our only way out. You see, I was involved in the very early work on teleporter technology, long before the Lambda Complex was even built. There may be enough equipment in the old lab to piece together a device that would allow us to teleport outside of the facility. As improbable as that may sound to someone like yourself. Sure. Of course, none of that does a whole lot of good while we're stuck in here. Hmm. Perhaps mm -hmm. I could help boost you through that vent in the ceiling. If you're lucky, you might be able to take those soldiers by surprise. Let's try this. <laughs> Power stance. Okay. Do I just jump on him? Oh, I do. Oh, sorry, buddy. You're strong, by the way. He's lifting an entire man and all his gear. Oh, come on. Oh, I see. Come on! Okay. You saw me. Is it just a three? I thought there was a ton more. Alright, I guess we go on, Dr. Magnuson. Uh, R R Rosenberg. Dr. All Rosenberg. Right. Now we'll need to head back to the area where you met Harold. The access to the old lab should be there, but we may have to break through some of the newer construction to get to it. Okay. Then that is what we shall do, Dr. Rosenberg. Just finishing up this chapter, Leo, and then I'm gonna go to bed. Uh, should I be bringing Dr. Magnuson with me, or? I don't think so. Okay, hold on a second. Okay, I don't think I'm supposed to bring Dr. Magnuson with me yet. Rosenberg. I keep forgetting it's Rosenberg, not Magnuson. God dang it. 
What's wrong with my brain? I'm coming with you to escape. Okay, generic doc. Thank you for literally doing nothing. Half light turned to counter strike. Uh, yeah. I mean, oh wait, this is this is an armor. Okay, good. Yeah. At this point, I am now a terrorist who is killing all of the United States military. I am a bad man. Alright, so this is the place where I killed those three guys earlier, so that made this journey a little bit easier. Uh, why am I going now, though? That door used to open, didn't it? No, this door opened, but it doesn't anymore. Okay, so I'm going down here. Oh, I see. Okay, he said I had to return to where I found Harold. Harold? And there he is. Hey, Harold. By the way, you have a pretty baby. Look at it. Ah, he's gonna grow up without a daddy. Wow, I just made myself sad. Uh, <laughs> I'm Batman. I don't know. I guess I am. Uh, store. Okay, so I want to go through here. Ah, this place was closed earlier. Ah. Okay, it's dead. Oh, come on. I had it. There we go. Wait. What? Wait, I hear another head crab. What the heck? All right, that's where I come. This is where I came in. This is where I came in. Okay. Maybe I did need to bring Dr. Rosenberg with me. Yes. Uh, this is Barney Calhoun. He is one of the security guards. And apparently he's a very prolific killer, Barney Calhoun is. He has no remorse for killing these men. In fact, in Half-Life 2, he jokes about it. It's a stone cold murderer, this guy. Alright, I guess you're coming with me this time. Right. You won't even know I'm here. I didn't know you were gone in the first place. You love this type of gameplay where you're just walking a guy across the map. I better be right about this, because if I have to do this again, I'm going to lose my freaking mind. Let's stick together. We're almost there. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where's this guy going?
Rosenberg. Rosenberg. Where are you going? You are kidding me. What is he doing? What is he doing? Now there's no time to waste. What the fuck? He just packed himself across the map all the way. What? Lead the way, Calhoun. Oh my god. Ah, uh, well, I'm clipping that. <laughs> wow. What the fuck is he doing? Alright, let's stick together. Are you coming? I can't believe this shit. Doc, no, I don't want to go where you're going. You follow me. Look, you gotta get cardio in wherever you can. <laughs> I don't even have a proper response for what just happened there. I think what happened was that he was meant to go there because that's where all the um, attacks started. Like I, we started being attacked. I'm afraid I need to rest. Okay. Yes, we'll have a better chance if we stick together. You are trying my very last nerve, Dr. Ro Robitussin. This game was not developed by Valve, because it's starting to show. Of course he needs to rest. He's, he just ran across the map three times. Of course he needs to rest. Oh, he's going to go slow now? What is this? Oh, uh, did I see? I thought I saw a head crab. What the hell? Did I just hallucinate a head crab? to get to the elevator. Oh. You've got to be kidding me. We should have chosen the Lambda reactor for an escape, but the crew there is bent on fighting the creatures, with all their hopes set on someone named Freeman. Let those fools try and fight a battle they can't win. I just want to get out of here. Alright. After you, my lord. Okay, so I think this is the end of the chapter, so I'm going to say this now. Thank you to Kacha. Thank you to Leo for talking with me. Thank you to Awakatebu Katebu? Awakatebu for following me. Everybody who watched this on Twitch, everybody who watches in the future on YouTube, I love you all. It doesn't seem like that was the end of the chapter. Yep, the elevator was behind a wood wall. Alright, I'm gonna scout ahead a little bit. In fact, that might just be a good place to, to quit, call it quits. Well, I see some more armor there. Ah, this is why I had to drag him across the map. I had to get his handprint right there. So even if I had come up here before he showed me the way, I would not have been able to get through that door. Oh, there's... There's a ton of armor here. Okay. Well, I'm going to leave alone for now. And I'm going to get Dr. Rosenberg to open that door. All right. Let's hope we don't run into any more of those soldiers. Well, I hope the old security system is still active. With any luck, my fingerprint ID is still valid and on file. Yeah, Leo, I am about to go to bed. So... Oh, hey. Wait! Dr. Rosenberg. This is the last area. Oh, you made it. We've managed to piece together some of the larger equipment, but you'll need to oversee the rest of the construction. Excellent, Walter. Finish aligning the power cell matrix, and I'll see if I can get the system online in the main room. Now there's no time to waste. 
This is the last area, you're right. I should just finish. You still there, Kachan? I might have to go tell Kachan I'm gonna finish the game, actually. Don't worry, Princess of Lolis, that's me. Give me a second. This is the final area. Let me see if Kachan is still awake. Oh, Kachan is still here. Okay. Well, looks like the equipment is in better shape than I expected. Unfortunately, this older technology does not have the ability to target an Earth destination in its current state. You see, oh, wait. Mr. Calhoun, teleportation isn't as easy as going from point A to point oh. B. No, it's not the last area. world that was somehow involved in the process, which kept us from accurately predicting where any given teleportation event would lead to back on Earth. Some of the more promising. Okay, hold on a second. All right. Uh huh. Okay, I remember. There is actually more to this game. Uh, let's see. Catch freight auto. Where does this one go to? Ah, uh, no, this is before I had Dr. Rosenberg. Okay. Alright, guys. <clears throat> no, this is... Okay, so there's a little bit more to this game. We actually have to go to Zen and travel through Zen and then come back to this world, and then we do the final area. So we are in the final area, but there's this whole section with Zen that we have to do first. Yeah. Yeah, we're, we're not even actually... But there's like maybe two or three more hours that... Okay. So, yeah, we're going to call it here. Yeah, I'm done, uh, Leo. I have to go to bed, and I'm not going to be able to finish tonight. So, yeah. Everybody who lived through that confusion, thanks for coming with me. Um, <laughs> uh, but I will see you guys later. Again, I love you all. Uh, well, I mean, I've got my save. I'm just going to, when I when I load up the game next time, I'm just going to use this save right here. So... Again, uh, I love you all, and I will see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>